Hello, everyone. Welcome to the show. Here to help us out today is OBGYN Dr. Anita Landry, who is back in the house. Hi. Also joining us Thank for you. our first topic today is environmental and consumer advocate Aaron Brockovich, who yes. is also rejoining us. And we brought in the big guns. And there's a reason nice that to have you back. that Aaron is here because you do so many great things. But our first topic is right in your wheelhouse. It's the topic of chromium six. This has also now been called the Aaron Brockovich chemical. I don't know if that's a good or a bad thing. I don't. I'm not sure how I feel about that. But, but, but. Let, let me tell you about this new study, and it was released from the Environmental Working Group that found 218 million Americans water contains levels of chromium six that the group considers dangerous. Most people probably haven't even heard of this chemical, but what does that mean? When, when that, that's the majority of Americans. Oh, that's two thirds of the country that are, are drinking varying levels of hexavalent chromium in their water, which is actually really very shocking to me. Um, and here's the map that Environmental Working Group, and it's not Environmental Working Group's data, by the way. This is data that the Environmental Protection Agency has that has not yet been put out because we're in a constant fight. So what do, what do the colors mean there? Because um, there's some blue, some yellow, and then some gray areas. The darker blues are where you see higher concentrations okay. of hexavalent chromium. The lighter blues are medium. The, the yellow is less. So what do people, what should we be worried about with chromium? What, what is the danger if this is in your water at too high of a level? Well, in the state of California, we finally set public health goals for hexavalent chromium in our drinking water, and that's set very low at 0.02 parts per billion. Anything beyond that could cause health implications. You know, when I did my work in Hinkley, we have huge situations out in Texas with very high levels of hexavalent chromium. We are seeing communities that have a lot of cancer. For me, what I want for the consumer is it's our water supply. We shouldn't have poisons in our water at any level, period. Where is it coming from? Where is this hexavalent? It's used by industry. Hexavalent chromium has been known as one of the best anti-rust corrosion inhibitors. And by the way, it's very cheap. Now, in Europe, it is banned from all industry as of January 2017. And that needs to happen here in America. We really are <laughs> lagging behind on some of our regulations. 